If you ever want to see how powerful a dildo can be as a weapon, that's how graphic it gets. Hello, welcome to another episode of Getting Graphic with Matt. Today I want to talk about something that I'm definitely not, sex criminals. <laughs> it's not what you think, obviously, obviously. <laughs> this beautifully weird and messed up comic book is by uh, Matt Fraction and Chip Zardaski. Two men who you should really know by now. Fraction has done some of the most kind of iconic runs on a lot of things and obviously his own comics. Chip Zardaski is in, right now in the middle of like a gigantic run of doing Daredevil, Batman, Spike. Like he's, I don't know how the hell he's doing what he's doing, but A plus work, Chip. Love your stuff. So Sex Criminals is, um, it's, it's, it's about, Criminals who like sex, but sex isn't just, you know, normal sex. Uh, in this particular universe, these two people who randomly manage to find each other can stop time when they orgasm. And obviously, what would you do if you could stop time? Rob some banks. That's what I'd do. I mean, obviously. It just keeps getting weirder and weirder and weirder as they go along. There's an incredible scene where they are singing Fat Bottom Book Girls by Queen, but Obviously, legally, they're not allowed to use the lyrics in the comic book because that's against copyright. So you just get uh, kind of a running commentary over it by Chip and Matt, just about what they wanted to put in here. And they talk about why they can't do it. And it is honestly one of the funniest things that you'll read in a really long time. I have all the trades myself, but uh, they also brought out the big hard sex criminals book, which I am going to be buying probably tomorrow because I mean, honestly, I love it. Also, shout out to uh, Rachel Stott, who did a, an issue at the very end of this run. Great work in that too. Really fit in with the entire uh, run. So if you like stuff that you really, you can't read this in public, they actually released several editions where they put a different cover on the front so you could read it in public. But if you know, you really want to go for it, buy this and read it on a bus and see what people think of you. What's the worst that could happen?